What's up everyone, Dinebot here. Welcome back to the Favorite Places to Fly 2023 World Tour. Now we are in Italy today. We have a couple airports to take off from, LIVD. And this is really a grass strip, so be careful if you're taking off here. Uh, I'm going to be taking off in a Beechcraft King Air. It will lift off on this runway. We're going to be heading to the west here. We're looking to check out some points of interest today. I'm going to go ahead and set our departure and arrival just so that you guys can have a visual on the uh, screen of what I'm doing, but we're going to really just be seeing what we can see. So I'm going to go ahead and hit fly here. Now, the idea here is to check out Castle San Michel, Brinko Castle, and maybe take a look at the Ross Sindamast and also the Messner Mountain Museum. One of them was opened here, the Coronis. So we're going to go ahead and fly and take a look. Now this is going to be a pretty scenic flight. Uh, like I said, if you're going to be taking off from the strip I'm using, take something that can get off the ground fairly quickly. The King Air, believe it or not, has plenty of room on this runway. Just don't think you're going to take a Learjet or something off here. So we are ready to fly. Throttle up. You can see my heading up there on the compass. This is going to be useful for those of you that maybe aren't as comfortable with VFR flying or just want a little helping hand. Let me go ahead and give you guys an outside view. We are... Uh, we're in the grass. So, I'm going to keep rolling. Should be good to rotate. Bring the gear up. And away we go. Now, I am going to change the weather up here. I am currently using the SoFly uh, Weather Preset Pro. I'm going to do another video on that probably, but... For now, let's go ahead and just get ourselves to some few clouds so that we can see a little better. And as you can see here, this is a really, really beautiful country. We're just going to be kind of snaking our way down the valley and over the hills here. Now, I mentioned the Ross Sindanast and the NMN Museum. They are actually right up there. I'm going to circle my mouse around them for you. On that mountaintop over there. Throttle back a little bit and just have a look. Really, really beautiful country. Maybe we don't want to go with big and bold. I'm just going to set us to epic high level. Hmm, no? There we go. So, as we come up here, you'll notice that I have come to the left some. Our actual uh, destinations are down there to the right. You can see the town of Brunek just on the top of that rise to the right wing tip. I'm going to go ahead and gain some altitude here and take a pass at the Cindermast and then dip us back down past Castle San Michel. Now, Brunek Castle was built in the 13th century by the bishop. Bruno von Kirchberg to protect his lands, and it laid the foundations for the city of Brunico or Brunek, depending on which way you're looking at it. And the Castle San Michel dates to around the same time, I believe. And here we are, we are coming in. We will be able to see the museum and the cinemas there. I'm going to try and dip us in as close as I can without taking the top off the mountain, so... You can see it passing by there on the right, and we just simply bank back down the valley, and we'll head for the... for the castle. Don't take this turn too tight, lest you make whoever's riding in the back of your plane sick. As I said, you're going to want something that has plenty of uh, plenty of power to stay up here. And 
and this is the joys of being able to do this in the sim and just to make videos because you would normally not be able to get away with what I'm doing. There is Castle San Michel down there and you can see it built into the top of the hill right there. And if we bank on around to the right, that'll be taking us into Brunick. There you can see what appears to be, I hope that was not the castle. I don't know, that's about the right spot for the castle, so it did not come out too well in the sim. Quite alright. But in addition to just the multiple, multiple points of interest around here, as you can see, this is just an absolutely beautiful piece of country to fly in. Lots of mountain valleys for you to head down if you want to do some interesting flights. I'll pull the VFR up here and you can see it's just a nice network that you can fly down each valley and explore to your heart's content. And here we see Brunico itself. But yeah, pretty interesting piece of Italy to take a flight over again up there. You can see our two other points of interest and behind us, Casa San Michel. So, yeah. That'll do it for me today, guys. Just a really interesting place to come fly. If you guys have any suggestions or places that you'd like to see me fly, leave them in the comments below. Like, subscribe, it really helps the channel out. And if you're here to the end, well, watch Simon's Key on YouTube. So thank you very much. My name is Dunbot, and I'll see you guys next time.